And hey there guys, Martin here again. We are fixing to do something. Uh, in trying to figure out what the undead are doing. Oh crap. Son of a bitch in the way. Kill it off here real quick, just, for, just because I can. Okay. <clears throat> Hopefully the loading screen will be there we go quick. Um yeah, uh kind of been slow on uploading videos here lately. Uh main reason being because before with the internet I had, when you uh, went to when I uploaded something, it would a fifteen minute video was like six hours. So yeah, it was mm, pretty crap. Uh, now it takes me about thirty minutes. So, so hopefully now I can. What can I do for you? A little quicker before this guy starts talking. Advocate, over here. Keep your voice low. The pirates are still spooked from Kellogg's attack. They won't be quick to trust newcomers. We need them to tell us what they know. How do we get them to talk? Don't worry, Advocate. The Order's been thinking ahead. It's what we do. Mm -hmm. The Order of Whispers is the oldest organization in Tyria. We've managed to survive this long because we always have a plan. All right, Ehan. I'm listening. What do you suggest we do? I've hidden special torches on the outskirts of the pirate camp. They're enchanted with pure life force by a priest of Melandru. The power of these torches will draw in the undead. But nobody else will notice the difference. Mm hmm Draw in the undead? That's dangerous. People could get hurt. These are no innocents, Advocate. They're pirates. And a cutthroat bunch at that. Bear that in mind. Disguise yourself and attempt to join the crew. When the undead attack, prove yourself defending the camp. They'll trust you after that. I'll maintain the torches and watch for undead. I'll be nearby in case the situation escalates out of control. Yeah, sounds like a plan. What can I do uh, for you? Can I get my disguise? Okay, yes. <laughs> Hurry me, matey. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm to light these things. Yeah, don't mind me, guys. Just. Well, I guess it's night time, so I guess it does make sense. It's a full moon. How appropriate. Fifteen men on a dead man's chest. Yo ho ho, and a bottle of rum drink, and the devil had done for the rest. Yo ho ho, and a bottle of rum. <laughs> kind of catchy. <clears throat> All right. You'll be visiting old Grant soon. Splendid view, isn't it? Only thing missing is our bloody ship. We never should have let that Seraf dog board the Ravenous again. Ravenous died a noble death, Captain. On fire and full of holes. She went down fighting, like the grand dame she was. Aye. That she did. That she did. Here. Who's this new lubber come to stare at us? Reporting for duty, Captain. They call me Yardarm, Rock Dog of the Eastern Sea. Yardarm. I hear you're looking for a new crew. You heard wrong. We're looking for brothers and sisters of fortune. Sailors that'll stand by us when the blood starts flowing. Now sling your hook before I... Captain, the undead are back. We're under attack. <coughs> Damn them. Look alive, scallywags. Time for some payback. Oops. You there, Yardarm! If you want to earn a berth on my ship, draw your weapon and risk your neck with the rest of us. Yeah. Why are the undead coming? I had nothing to do with it. Uh, I think they're running away from us. Who keeps this shit? I thought they were supposed to attract them. Oh, whoop. Well, I guess I changed the mind.
I earned you, Bastion. Damn your eyes! Is that it? <clears throat> Am I missing something? Uh oh, here they are. Thought I heard something. Get up. Okay. about me guys I got it Damn your eyes. get up you lazy pricks <laughs> okay simple enough There, was that good enough for you? Go away, you scurvy yak. You bitch. There. Don't get in my way. Uh, you did well, Yardum. But we're looking. But if you were looking to join my crew, fighting ain't enough. You'll need sharp wit too. <laughs> what an asshole. Crude chilling words. Killing your. Okay. Uh. Did I just do this? Oh, Roman. A vast. <clears throat> Are you ready for your ears to turn blue? I'm ready. Alright, here we go. Alrighty, here we go. <clears throat> Shut your hatch, you lily livered buildrat. Uh, yeah. Spirit, you're trying to take me. Ice infested. Yeah, pretty much just go with the longest out of the way names. Let's see, fair and tight, turn your head. Yeah. So pretty much if you want to insult a pirate, just come up with three animal names. Yeah. 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 Me mighty. You fight like a pack of wolves, Yardarm. I take you aboard in the blink of a mermaid's eye. Trouble is, my ship is busy cozying up with the seafloor. Gates, you tell the tale. Laying out our bad luck will set me to weeping like a quaggan. A seraph by the name of Kellogg came calling on our seer. Naturally, we thought we'd feed him to the sharks, but he had coin and promise of more. We plundered an Orion cruiser, plucked her treasures right under the old dragon's nose. Kellogg wanted the lot. We sold him for a pretty penny. Then he comes back a few nights later, screaming for the seer Alastia Crow. He grabs her by the throat and says he'll kill her unless she removes some curse he's under. Behind him come undead like the plague. He ignores them, doesn't even know they're there. And I hear a last year whisper to him, blood of royalty. <laughs> Kellogg stabs a last year and rushes off screaming, leaving us there to the mercy of the undead. They scuttled our ship and ruined everything. That's the sad story of the landlocked Ravenous. These are bitter days to be a pirate. I'm sorry to hear that. But I'm looking for work as a sailor, not a sellsword. If your ship's not seaworthy, it's best we part ways. Okay. So, we talked to Agent. Okay, yeah, we found out what happened. Hello, stranger. How little one did attack went off without a hitch? How did it. Play, how did it play with the pirates? Round spades. <coughs> Risk is measured by reward. Okay. 
Remove it, that is not possible. The Zaitun's corruption can't be undone, so he's fucked. Okay. Blood of royalty. Okay. Well, that does it for that part. Cool. Okay. Now we are going to go and report and probably decide the next, next course of action. The camera zoomed in so far. Uh, okay, so I gotta talk to all of them. Yay. Some must fight so that all may be. Okay, maybe not. Captain Thackeray, I'm glad you're here. We've got an urgent situation. Kellogg's been corrupted by Orion artifacts. The pirate Alastia told him that the Queen's blood will cure the corruption. Duena's mercy. I have to protect the Queen. We can't let him near her. That's all you do. I think the undead are following him because he has the artifact. As long as he's out there, they'll be right on his heels. We don't have much time. The undead mob he's leading is just getting bigger. Kellogg's growing more dangerous by the second. We can't just think of the Queen. We have to think of Kryda. If we just defend her, Logan, Kellogg will destroy every town from Lion's Arch to Divinity's Reach. You're right. Damn it. But when it comes to my duty to the Queen... Well, never mind. I'm listening. What's the plan? It's time to assault Kellogg head-on. In the vigil, we swear an oath to stand between the darkness and the light. The only way to be sure is to face this threat directly. Head on, that's hell yeah. Join us. You'd make a fine member of the vigil, and I'd be proud to fight by your side. Don't be thick-headed, Hiroki. Knowledge is power. The Durman Priory's research is conclusive. The Advocate would be much better suited among our scholars. Come, Advocate. We can use the Mortis Verge enchantment to protect the Queen, and neutralize this threat intelligently. Kellogg has two things on his side. An army of undead, and complete insanity. We have to use cunning, lure him in, and then trick him into destroying himself. The Order of Whispers wants you on our side, Advocate. All you have to do is say the word. All right, everyone. Give me a moment to discuss my options with Captain Thackeray. Then I'll let you know how I'm going to proceed. I already know. Head on. Uh... The hell is he? Oh. Greetings. Yeah, they all want my help. What do you think about it? You can do more. Flood orders. You should seize this opportunity. Okay. Yeah, I'm ready. No questions about it. Never leave a comrade behind. The vigil has a place for you, hero. You're brave, stalwart, and compassionate. Everything we look for in a recruit. Remember, this is a permanent decision. Will you join us? Yep. Ah, <laughs> uh, reward. Finished with that. Alright, cool. Well, that's going to wrap up this one. Uh, Hopefully you can actually get it uploaded today. And um, as always, leave a like, comment, dislike it, favorite, share it, do Jack Diddley for the two people that wander in here and watch this. Alrighty, and thank you, and we'll catch you next time.